Hey guys, welcome back to another video, and today I am talking about um, another Flash movie news that I have been holding out for a while, and that is George Clooney might be coming back as Batman. Now, um, rumors have been going around that um, he that the Flash will be going into the multiverse, so he might be grabbing different Batmans. So that's why when I did the now the official Batman say coming back are Michael King and um, Ben Affleck. Uh, Val Kilmer is uh, one that has been rumored. Um, George Clooney is another one that's been rumored. Um, and Batman Robin to me, uh, which is the movie that George Clooney is starting, he was like not the worst part of that film um he's definitely not one of the best parts but he's definitely not one of the worst parts of that film i love batman and robin uh because batman movies are meant to be dark and serious but batman and robin is totally the opposite it's light it's goofy it's absolutely hilarious um it's much like the adam west show from the 60s it's that but um for the 90s and the Dutch angles and all that. So that is exactly what Batman Robin is. So that is um, what's going to go down. Now, I'm curious to see how this whole Batman thing is going to play off because the Flash is either, it's like you get cameos where the Flash will be reigned to multiple universes and then we can see Val Kilmer, George Clooney. If Christian Bale's going to come back, we can get Christian Bale. Uh, maybe Robin Pattinson can jump into it at some point. Um, even we can have some Supermans coming around. Um, so it's either do that, or there's some sort of big threat that's can take more than just the Flash. So he would need to grab Michael Keaton, Ben Affleck, Val Kilmer, George Clooney, Christian Bale, um, and all and Supermans and Batman's all over the all over the multiverse, so they can take down this one threat. So, I am kind of curious to see where this movie goes. So far on board, we have... Um, so, so far we have um, Ezra Miller, which is coming back, who is coming back as a flash. He kind of has to be at this point. Um, ben Affleck as the DC Universe's Batman. And Michael Keaton as 1989's Batman. Um, so, George Clooney, I'm very excited to see what's going to happen. Even though that the only thing that I'm kind of concerned about with all these Batman is that Batman... Uh, sorry. George Clooney and... Uh, yeah, George Clooney and Val Kilmer play the same Batman. So that will be weird. Or you do the thing where it's in multiple universes maybe... Val Kilmer kind of has a darker, uh, well, maybe George Clooney has like a more darker suit and is more serious, and he's a great Batman, everyone loves him. And Val Kilmer is the one from Batman Forever. And the other thing that concerns me is that this is going to completely um, ruin the whole uh, Batman. Batman Returns, Batman Forever, and Batman, Batman and Robin are all connected. Or it's just one of those things where it's like, look, those are, exist in the one universe, but Michael Keaton is the 1989 version, um, and Val Kilmer is a different Batman, and George Clooney is a different Batman, and Ben Affleck is our Batman. So... That's what I'm kind of curious about this film. Um, but yeah, so guys, please let me know down below if you guys um, are excited about this. I'm definitely excited to see George Clooney back as Batman. Um, I just hope that they make it more of a dark, gritty Batman. I hope that he does the Michael Keane thing at the beginning of Batman 1989 where he grabs a guy and goes, I'm Batman. Not the thing where he falls down in Batman Robin. Because we all know what happens then. Hi, Freeze. I'm Batman. So, guys, please, um, 
hit the like button down below if you haven't already. Hit subscribe. Also click the little bell icon to get notified of future videos that I make. So I'll see you guys later. Take care. Bye. Hey there. Subscribe to my channel. And also press this bell icon.